Hey guys, welcome to People English. My name is Anne. I'm so excited to have you here for our class. We're going to learn some phrasal verbs, but don't worry, we're not going on this journey alone. I want to invite our friend Bob to help us. Hey, Anne. I heard we're exploring phrasal verbs today. Count me in. Absolutely, Bob. We're going to visit some places and demonstrate these phrasal verbs in action. Let's get started. And why did you stand up? Let's sit down and chat about these phrasal verbs. I only stood up to attend a customer. I'm really excited to got out and walk around town and practice these phrasal verbs. We're actually already doing that right now. Look, stand up, Bob. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. Now pick up the cup of coffee. Put the cup down. Pick up. Put down. Let's go out of the coffee shop and learn more phrasal verbs outside. Get out, Cat Felix. Go play outside. Get out. We arrived at the park. And to continue learning some phrasal verbs, our friend Bob is going to demonstrate the phrasal verb run away. Come on, Bob. Run away, or the dog will bite you. What? Run away. Run away. Help! I never agreed to that. Help! 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 Run away. Run away. <laughs> <laughs> You won't believe what crossed my mind while I was nailing that surprise and shock marathon you had me on. I think you've cracked the code to English lessons. With your four-legged coach, the runaway phrasal verb is forever stamped in my brain. <laughs> Relax, Bob. To make it up to you, I have a present for you. While you were mastering the runaway phrasal verb, I picked up a pair of sunglasses for you. And let's use this moment to practice butt on and take off phrasal verbs. Put on your sunglasses. Take them off. Put on. Take off. We're now going to the library to show you two phrasal verbs in action. going to the library to read some of those old books, which are full of knowledge accumulated over centuries. However, today we are here to demonstrate the use of a few phrasal verbs. What do you think about it, Bob? It will be a pleasure to help. I hope you don't have any four-legged friends hiding in the back. We are going to start by demonstrating the phrasal verbs climb up and climb down. Climb up the ladder, Bob. That's why I'm as fit as a squirrel on a treadmill, with all the animal chases, stairmaster sessions, and weightlifting you subject me to in your English classes. <laughs> Come on, Bob. No complaining, okay? Climb down. Climb up. Climb down. And finally, here's your chance to master the phrasal verb give back. So, you can finally give back those books you borrowed from the library a year ago. What? Oh no! Anne! <laughs> Our day today was really fun, wasn't it, Bob? Do you mean really fun or really funny? Oh, Bob, you make me laugh. I love working with you. And if you're enjoying our classes, don't forget to unleash a flying kick on that thumbs Ooh. up. Yeah! And if you're not subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and nail that red button down below.